Hi, I'm Lisa, and I'm here to help you get started with your new Smart Parts OptiPix digital picture frame. In no time, you'll have your frame loaded with pictures and be ready to go. Let's start by setting up your frame. First, slide the frame stand into the slot on the back of the frame. The frame can be set up horizontally or vertically to best match your pictures. You can also use the keyhole mounts on the back of the frame to mount it on a wall horizontally or vertically. Next, plug the power adapter that came with the frame into the wall and into the power jack on the side of the frame. Finally, use the power switch to turn the frame on. Now you're ready to add pictures to the frame. There are two ways to view pictures on your frame. The first way is to insert a memory card directly from your camera into your frame, or copy pictures from your computer to a memory card and insert that into the frame. You can also plug a USB drive with pictures on it into the USB port. The frame will automatically display a slideshow of the pictures on the card. You can also use Smart Parts OptiPix Pro software to transfer pictures from your computer directly to your frame. The OptiPix Pro software optimizes the size, color, and sharpness of your pictures to make them look great on your frame. It also has a feature called Smart Fit that can fit your pictures exactly to the screen size of the frame automatically without cropping or distorting your main subject. To get started using the OptiPix Pro software, connect your frame to your computer using the USB cable included with your frame. Now you can install the software directly from the frame itself or you can always download the latest version at www.optipix.com. Once you've installed the software, follow the prompts to copy your pictures, music, and video to your frame. Once a memory card is inserted into your frame or pictures are copied to the internal memory, it's easy to view them. Just turn on the frame and you'll see the main menu. Using the arrow and enter buttons on the remote control or the rocker switch and OK button on the frame, choose View Your Pictures. The frame will show you the pictures in its internal memory or on any memory cards you've inserted. You can choose to view a single picture and then use the arrow keys to move between pictures. Or you can play a slideshow of all the pictures by pressing the play or slideshow buttons on the remote. If you press the setup key while you're viewing pictures, you can adjust the brightness, contrast, color, and tint to make your frame look great in any room light. To return to the view your pictures menu, press the exit key. Press the exit key again to return to the main menu. From the main menu, you can also choose to play music or video files that are on your frame. You choose music or videos just like you choose pictures. You can also adjust various settings on your frame in the settings menu. You can choose to turn on multiple picture display, which shows more than one photo at a time. You can also adjust various settings for your slideshows. These include how long each picture is displayed and which transition effect is used between pictures. When you're finished, press exit to go back to the main menu. Thanks for watching. We hope you'll take the time to explore some of the other options you'll find on your OptiPix digital picture frame, and we know you'll enjoy your pictures more than ever.